at this place. No one's been here in centuries. I doubt there's any other place like it in Skyrim. It's beautiful. Hello there, kids. This is uh, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim. Now, when we left off, Serana was just saying how wonderfully beautiful this place looks, and considering how all of Skyrim looks, and the places we've gone recently. But, uh, now it's time, I guess, to talk to moths and see what we can glean from these scrolls. Yeah, that's a thing. Okay. <laughs> Although I don't want to take this ritual lightly, it does sound pretty far-fetched. Okay, I guess we gotta go to that thing. <laughs> With that light, it sound it looks well not sounds rather, but looks much more celestial than it probably is. Uh the draw knife. Seems very Those are very intricate carvings there. Track down one of those canticle trees. Canticle trees. Which would be any of the three, I guess? That are like nearby? You could probably go with the uh, nearby one here because everything else is like further up. Oh, this is a pretty tree though. Oh, damn. Harvest uh, canticle bark. Just a little bit. There we go. Yeah, just a little bit. Well, hopefully. Now I gotta attract the swarms. Which, uh... Can sometimes be hard to see. Whoops. So I'm gonna be going to third person for that. Okay. There's one. Alright. There we go. They've definitely taken a liking to you. Yep. Am I? I can't really see it right now. But uh, I'll see it in a moment, I'm sure. I have to keep looking around to be able to see the other ones. And then I'll be able to see more of this glimmer the more I collect, I assume. Oh, there's another one. There we go. Yeah, I am starting to light up a little bit. There we go. Oh. Yeah, I'm, there's definitely a uh, shining light around me. Alright, there's another one. And there we go. Oh yeah, there it is. It's starting to appear a lot more, you know, pronounced now. It's kind of cool, actually. It looks like a permanent sunspot around my body. Uh, balls. Let's see if we can... Yeah, there we go. Trying to see if I can find any of the others. Oh! Apparently they respawn, I guess, maybe. <laughs> uh... Otherwise, there'd be another one over here. So. There's two more. Oh, there's one. And where's the last one? Now it makes it hard to see because... Not only are you trying to see through your own glimmer, you're trying not to mistake the ones around you as new ones. Oh, there they are. All right, there, perfect. Yeah, I think so. All right. Yeah, we are definitely surrounded in some sort of light. This is. This is definitely supposed to be uh, holy in some way. And now we go down to, to the sunbeam and read the scrolls in. Doesn't really matter what order, does it? Uh, first would probably be the first one we got, which is blood. Or is it sun? That doesn't matter. I just need to read one. Nervous? Not really. Ooh. Okay, that is very bright. Okay, there's a path forming. Don't know what it means. Looks like some sort of fissure. Or like... 
Is it a path? Path into some mountains by the look at the top there. What's that in the top right corner? Oh geez, I'm blind. I'm blind. I can't see nothing. No. Did I? You, you were able to see that through my fur? <laughs> Are you okay? Almost thought I lost you there. You went as white as the snow. Yeah, you said that. Uh, that felt strange. <laughs> I could see it in your eyes. You looked about a thousand leagues away. I probably was. What about Ariel's bow? Do you know where we can find it? Vaguely. It's in a place called Darkfall Cave. Then it's almost over. We can finally put an end to this ridiculous prophecy. Where is Hopefully. this Darkfall Cave? The scrolls gave me its exact location. Then let's get going. Hopefully. I want to get there before my father has a chance to track us down. Hopefully it wasn't just like some drug-induced vision with all the moths flapping around us. What do you know about Oriel's bow? Not much. If you read any history, it shows up from time to time, but it's a hard thing to track. Ah. As far as I know, though, it's never been held by a vampire. That would be a new one. Probably. Well, it's going to be held by a werewolf first, if anything. Uh, what does it have to do with the sun? Ariel is one of the elven gods. Ah. He's with the rest of them in Aetherius. The way I've heard it, the sun represents the connection from our world to theirs. Mm -hmm. Supposedly, the bow draws its energy from the sun Whoa. itself, which is why okay. it shows up. Okay, there's some prophecy. shit going on. Okay, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> well, we'll discuss this later. Oh, shit. Holy tits! My health went down fast. Woo! Boy. Get okay. on here. Pop some heal into my veins, and we're good. Come on, there we go. That one's dead. Gargoyle brute, come on. You're down. No, it's gonna be. Okay. There we go. Now you are, anyway. Okay. Oh, I forgot. I have magic that I can use now. Oh well, shit. Um, that's not my favorite. So I wanted to go to conjuration. There we go. Oh, uh, Rathman. And and grab whatever this guy had. There we go. Oh geez. Okay. Not good. Not good at all. Really not good. Uh, Jesus. They are really trying to kill me right now. <laughs> I didn't think that they'd be able to do that much damage. I need a lot of fucking health potions. Holy fuck. Did not realize it was that far out. Oh boy. Okay, let's grab my sword again. There we go. Uh, oh, that's where the uh, others are. Oh, then there's my uh, conjuration there. Oh, he has a dragon bone sword in him. Didn't figure that would be there. This walker's down. And Master Vampire. That's probably the one that was killing me with the uh, cold there. Okay. Gonna definitely take all their shit. Did I ever check this guy? I don't think so. Uh, I might have. I'm just gonna check the other body. Uh, shit. <laughs> that came at the weirdest time. Didn't expect that. Uh, yeah, I must have searched that guy, because this guy, I don't remember having this. Well, the last search I did, anyway. So, yeah, let's try and finish up what the fuck we were trying to learn from her. Run it. No. Not much. Yeah, that's as far as Zoom I know, through this. All right. Yeah. The way I yeah. hear, supposedly the bow yeah. draws its energy from the sun itself, mm -hmm. which is why it shows up in that prophecy. Ah, what exactly does it do? In that part, I don't know. Once we have it, hopefully it'll be obvious. Hopefully, key phrase. Uh, yeah, let's get going. My guy disappeared. Why is your guy still around? Okay. All right. Anyway, what? <laughs> Good doing that. That's yellow mountain flower. I've never seen a yellow mountain flower. Uh, at least I don't remember seeing one. Let's see what it does. Uh, there. T 
taste that. Resist poison. Alright, I'm gonna collect these a little bit. Uh, <laughs> mainly because this is a new ingredient that I don't remember seeing ever, and I want to test with it. I'm gonna find out some shit. I'm gonna find out how good it is. Okay. Lydia, can you put a lid on your thrall, please? Jeez, that is... God damn. Okay. Uh, nothing else really going on. And the moths are still where they are, so there's that. Huh. Or maybe that was one that I didn't actually grab. Huh. And I think there's... Yeah, there's another one over near that waterfall that I didn't grab. Alright, well, now I know. Let's get out of here. But Serana! What the fuck are you doing? Serana! Okay. Let's just get out. Get out. Hopefully she'll follow right after me. Hopefully, key phrase. Uh, there. Alright. And let's get the fuck out of here. Man, who would have thought that all of that beauty was through a snowy cave? Oh, man. Guess that little, uh... What's the word I'm looking for? Skylight-ish sort of thing. Kept most of the snow out. Just made a wonderful little oasis in there. There you are. Why is your hood not on? Crazy? Crazy? Okay. That's a glitch that sometimes happens, I guess. Sometimes happens. Or, wait a minute, what time is it? 8.44 a.m. You definitely should have your hood on, girl! What the fuck? Okay. Yeah, that is a glitch, though. That is a glitch that sometimes happens. Um, where do we go next? That's not that. That's not the thing we go to next. Uh, shit. Do I have to pop it? Yeah, I do. I do. Okay. What do I have in my inventory? A lot of stuff. So we're going to probably drop that off first before we do anything else. Head back home. Head back to the home area. Falkreath. Yeah, we could sell some of the stuff and then dump the rest. Because I have a feeling we're going to be grabbing a lot of shit over where we're going. Considering we've been going a lot of places where there's a lot of shit to grab, I might as well. Ugh. Might as well drink my soda while I'm waiting for the load. There we go. Helps keep my voice at peak operating condition. That's a lie. Swoop <laughs> down at any time. Are you sure about that? Considering I killed the majority of them? Oh, now your hood's up. Okay. Right. Always sneaking about. Racist! You racist. How dare you speak so ill of the Khajiit. How dare you. You are a racist. Okay. I should probably stop. Steel's good, but loyalty's better. I'm loyal to Dengir first, and the Empire second. Good to know. I don't really care. Finest weapons and armor. All right, there we go. Uh, let's sell that weapon I remember having. Yeah, you know, the iron sword of shocks, the workers bow of animus. Sell this and sell this. There we go. Basically good on that front. Uh, this is all stuff that doesn't really matter too much. Magic armor generates 125 percent faster holy crap that is really fast i'm assuming that's no, actually that is the uh, armor that serana is already wearing so even if i give that to her it's just gonna look the exact same so hmm should i sell it yeah fuck it we'll sell it why not everything else i'm just going to be adjusting for you know whatever anyway so might as well okay yeah i think we're good we're good. See me at my forge if you need arms. Yep, can do. Uh, let's see what else we have that I probably don't need. 
got quite a bit. Okay. <laughs> this is probably going to take a while. <laughs> now that I think about it. Because I don't remember everything I grabbed that is basically needed to sell. <laughs> and also, I have a lot of gold. I, th I thought that was like you know, 20,000. How did I get this far into the house? Holy shit. Okay. Well met. Some may call this yeah. junk. Let's Me, sell you some I shit. I call them huh? treasures. Oh, uh, Solaf. Yeah, I, we, we, I beat you guys. Honestly. <laughs> uh, sorry, but kind of how it worked. Uh, that's, uh, yeah, sell that, yeah. Uh, the gold emerald ring, we're gonna throw that in the house once we're back. Uh, two-handed attacks. I'm pretty sure mine, yeah, it does more than that. So sell that. Bring a minor destruction. I don't think I really need that. Uh, maybe I do. No, I, I'm pretty sure I don't. Uh, just checking. Yeah, I have destruction there, so there's absolutely no need for this. Whoops, uh, I didn't even realize you had so little. Oh, whatever. You got a freebie there, but Steal anything from my yep. shop and you'll regret it. Yeah, yeah, about that. I don't care. <laughs> Let's get going. All right. Oh no! I can't believe we let provincials like you wander Skyrim. Hey there, sorry about that. Uh, realize I didn't set myself too busy when I started recording. Oopsie doodle. So, uh, fixing that now. And, uh, we're gonna cut out the name. Just so they don't, uh, get mobbed with, uh, things. <laughs> mobbed with, uh, questions and whatnot. Anyway. Uh, Dark Vault Cave. Dragon Tooth Crater is apparently the closest we're gonna get, so we're gonna go there. <clears throat> Head up north that way. Alright. Time Receptum brought peace to Tamriel in 2E895 96 by conquering all the known world. This thus began the Third Era. Well, if that began eras, then shit. Alright. Now we have to go north, so this way is the way to go. Okay. Is there any way to get a... Oh. Okay. That is what I assume be... Yeah. I assume they were vampires. Down you go. And the other one died. Hey! Cool beans. Take your shit. Uh, scroll of mayhem. I'll definitely take that. You sucked. So hard. Alright, take this. Wow, they had basically fuck all. That was actually kind of bad. Well, maybe I'm just spoiled by Fallout 4's loot table at this point. Who knows? Probably that, to be perfectly honest. Alright. And... We should probably go around this campsite, to be perfectly honest. Uh huh. Oh geez! Okay. Uh fuck. I didn't wanna run into you. I didn't wanna run into you. I don't wanna kill you! I don't wanna kill you! Really don't wanna kill you! Okay. No! Oh. Serana. Uh, you're killing me here, man. Killing my tr trying to be peaceful saber cats because they're basically dying out. God damn it, Serana. Asshole. Fuck. What a asshole? <laughs> I don't know why I pronounce it like that. Uh, there's a bunch of bunch of these oh oh no dawn guard orders i don't remember this guy we received word of an increase in vampire activity in western skyrim in the coming weeks we plan to dispatch several more agents to the region 
and need to establish a network of wilderness supply drops to support them. You are to plant cachets in the following locations on a small island south of Solitude Sawmill, due east of the entrance to the ruined Volskiga, on the east side of Carthwestern Bridge. <laughs> Excuse me. If these reports are to be believed, the situation may be far more dangerous than you realize. Be cautious. Apparently, he uh, didn't listen to that. Cache key. That's actually nice. And yeah, you are you are done, my friend. Sad to say. I'm sure you died valiantly, given the looks of these. You uh, you killed them good. That's for damn sure. I shall make sure you are recommended the highest honors in Dawnguard's thing. <laughs> I don't honestly know how it would work. But, uh, damn. That's the first time I've ever seen... Oh, man. I feel bad for you. Dawnguard Warhammer. Oh, jeez. That's the first time I've ever seen that, and I feel kind of bad. Considering I don't recognize the name. It's like, I feel like I should. Anyway. Let's uh, see how much closer we are to it. It's probably the cave we need to go to right now. And we will definitely be checking out those uh, cache drops when we get the chance. Uh, whoa! That was not what I intended. God, I hate when that happens. Okay, let's check the map. Yeah, that is definitely the one I'm trying to get to. Uh, how in hell's bells am I going to get there, though? Do I get on the other side of the river? Okay. Well, I uh, kind of don't want to deal with this violently. Considering Serana fucked my uh, attempt to be peaceful earlier. But uh, at the same time, it's a cave bear. And they're kind of a menace. So, there we go. Get across the river here. There we go. Okay. There we go. Alright. I don't feel good about that, but. Like I said, they're a menace. Saber cats, you leave them alone, they'll uh, leave the world alone. But bears will not do that. <laughs> oh. All right. Let's uh, swap the fire bolts because I haven't used those in a while. There we go. And there we go. Ho <laughs> ho. There we go. We're done here. Oh, I th thought this was actual. Oh, it is? Okay. <laughs> Thought it was something I could actually harvest ingredients from, and it was. Good for me. Alright. Head up here, because this is the place we need to go through. Oh, there we go. Got stuck on a fucking rock for like five seconds. Darkfall Cave. That is the place that we need to go to. And uh, we're going to wait for Serana to... <laughs> gradually catch up to us <clears throat> and i'm gonna end the episode here for right now thank you all so much for watching click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more and click the like button if you like this particular video and share and comment so we can bring more people into this community we can talk about the games we're playing together i will see y'all in the next episode this has been the one the only stray cat playing games for you <laughs>